Okay, this one is about the Carrier 398 AAV furnace. This is one of their earlier 90% furnaces, vented with plastic pipe, uh, and efficiency was 90 plus. I'll show you a close-up of the uh, model and serial on this thing uh, in a minute. Okay, uh, we're going to look at kind of an overview of how this thing works. Uh, we'll get a little closer to some of the controls. Okay, this is, uh, you can see just part of the integrated furnace control right here. This is a, an early form of an integrated furnace control. It did not have any code blink lights. This one uh, had nothing like that. So what they did, because sometimes you don't know why something doesn't work, if you don't have some sort of indication and you can't dig into the board itself, it has a self-test. And I'm going to go over that self-test. Okay, if you wanted to test this board and the components that it controls, there's a self-test feature right here. Now if I just jumper those, and you don't have to leave them jumpered, you just put a jumper across it and now you can hear the inducer came on. Okay next the hot surface igniter is going to come on. I've taken off the burner cover here so you can see that. It's going to show that it glows. Now the fan's going to go on high speed and then you'll hear it go to low speed. There you can hear it go to low speed. Okay, it's finished the self-test now. So just because it doesn't have lights doesn't mean you can't diagnose things. If any of those things don't happen, then it's telling you there's an issue either with the board or the component or a plug or some silly thing like that. Okay, let's look at some of the rest of the components on this thing. Uh, right here is the P-trap and the drain. Uh, those do get dirty and they need to be cleaned occasionally probably with a uh, service. Here's your inducer, pressure switch, your vent pipes here, here's the gas valve. Okay, here's the combustion chamber with burners and everything inside there. And on top here is where you'll put your combustion air inlet. That's pretty much all the components that are in this thing. It's actually pretty simple for a 90% uh, furnace. Okay, now we're going to check that hot surface igniter and let this thing go through a cycle. Okay, burners have come on and it's proved. So, uh, have a delay here and then the fan motor is coming on and the cycle will be complete. Okay, there's a fan motor has come on and everything's complete. 